This state senator Hank Coe from Cody and I chair Senate Education and have a very uh, huge bill in Senate File 104 that we just debated yesterday for two hours. And uh, what it really does, it takes a lot of the duties that the state superintendent has and gives them to a new director chosen by the governor. Reasons for this bill are clear. Uh, the lack of cooperation from the department and education accountability measures, stuff that we put into law, uh, she has not complied with. I want to address the constitutionality of it. If you go to Section 1, Article 7 of our Constitution, it says, and duties as prescribed by law for the state superintendent. The bill is clearly constitutional. There's been a lot of concern by people around the state that it wasn't. The sponsorship on the bill is also really relevant here because it's uh, uh, sponsored by the entire leadership in the House and the Senate, as well as the minority party leadership. All of the Education Accountability Committee, all of my Senate Education Committee, and most of the House Education Committee chaired by Representative Teeters. So that's what's going on. This bill had a two-hour debate yesterday, passed first reading uh, this morning. Past second reading with some amendments that are constructive amendments. Uh, tomorrow will be third, and third reading and final passage in the Senate, then the bill will move to the House. So, and I'm very confident about the vote tomorrow on third reading and final passage.